Hey orange, <clears throat> hey orange one here. So in the last episode we got this well set up and we did our little dwarfy project and we got some water um, storage set up. I'm pretty happy about that. I think that because of that we're going to be we're going to be doing okay. Um, I would like to get some water brought up, but I think that we have water. Like if I click on this, uh, there's four units of water there. I don't know if someone's bringing uh, buckets up of water or if that's just what naturally accumulated up here. But it would be nice to have some water that's actually closer to the hospital. Um, we do have also, from what I remember, we couldn't see anyone that was injured, but we wanted to engrave some stuff for people who had died. Yeah, we can't see any injuries. So let's go ahead and go to our tomb. Because we've we've lost some dwarves. <laughs> A fair amount, actually. Um, are there any other building uh, receptacle, uh, burial receptacles? N? Are there any more of those that I can make? Yeah, let's just do a few of those because I feel like we may have enough for everyone, but we also may not. Let's respect the dead because we don't want to get haunted. And they also died for us, so we should at least build them something, right? And then also just to make things nice, let's put another one here. Now, once all of these get filled up, I'm gonna have to figure something else. So Hawking's dead there, so we're gonna want to engrave something for Hawking. So if I go to dig, and engrave right there, and look at the details, historical figure, uh, filter. Where's Hawking? I don't see him. Um, related to sight. No, that's not what I want. Creature, no. How do you spell his name? Yeah, Hawking. So, do see Malmosh. Um, uh, so can I remove that designation? Because it doesn't seem to be working the way I want it to be. D. And then can I look for... Unib? I don't think that was their name. Hmm. What about boar? Can we engrave something for boar? What if I look at our site? I'm just not sure. Uh, existing image. And I do E here and do bore. I do. Yeah, bore we can do. Bore is apparently important enough. So Boar can get something. 
Poor Hawking, for some reason, didn't show up. Yeah, I guess Hawking's just not important enough. Well, that's unfortunate. Um, I do it through here. No. What if I did a jabber? We could make a jabber. Pretty sure it was a male jabber, wasn't it? Let's just do a generic jabber. One. Um, no, keep working. And... Can we show it being, uh, <laughs> being tortured? Or is dead. Okay, so the X is dead. And then I think Y would be done. Good. And then what about these other guys? Margulis. I don't think you were um, going to be important enough, Margulis. Because I didn't even name you. I guess you are important enough. Hmm. Pauling. Okay, let's give Pauling some engraving. So dig E. Wow, it's, that's pretty lame that the dwarves are like, oh, well, this one guy is uh, not important enough. Okay. Ride. Okay, let's give Ride a burial spot right here. E. -E. I don't see Ride on this list. It's a really long list though. I think we're gonna narrow it, need to narrow it down. Um, Kulet to the Tsar. Okay. Yeah, I don't see, um... I don't see right there. That's unfortunate. Um, we're gonna have to go with... Use an existing image. No, uh... Let's do like um maybe we could do like a hammer or something. So I'm pretty sure it's a hammer that killed uh killed the enemy. Let's do a war hammer. It's one. working yeah be done with that and I'm pretty sure that's all of the ones that are currently available oh these uh, these are engraved so that is for that dude but let's see who's buried here Mosses the first one that charged in there with their bare fists, I remember. Oh, 
what was his name? Moss Mosses F. Okay. Yep. Alright, so we got things getting engraved, that's good. I bet as soon as these people get these things built, we'll be able to fill them up. Yeah, get those available. While they're doing that, what's um what's our stockpile of iron looking like? Yeah, we don't have a lot of it, and we've got some. We just got some battle axes. That's good. Could I make some shields? I always misspell shield. Could I make like uh, six of those? And I would also like some the leather cloaks. That'd be nice. Could I actually get like 50 of those? I'm actually going to put an order on for that. Um, conditions. Uh, products. Is that most 10? Let's make it um, <clears throat> at most 100. So if we don't have 100, they're going to make orders of 50. That should have us covered pretty well. Yeah, the one thing with how I play this game is that this, uh, this message becomes these series of messages become absolutely unbearable. Oh yeah, this dude wanted a tome. Uh, okay, so build and repair receptacle. And then he's also going to want some something to make this a little bit nicer, so we'll give him some containers. Iron chests. Like the other lord. That should be good. Good to go. I kind of want to see what ends up getting engraved, but I don't know when that's going to be done. This needs to be a tome. Make it a little bit smaller. Like that. And that will be for... Linnaeus, I'm pretty sure, was the noble that was prying about their tome. And then also the, uh, they want to have their office or their own dining room. Is this Linnaeus' bedroom? Yes, it is. Um, he needs a table. Build table. I don't have a table. I don't have a table? Can I get an iron table, please? And maybe a rock. Oh, uh, that rock table is going for infinity. Uh, can I cancel that? Let's get like five of those made. I really need to get my iron industry going a little bit more. Well, that storage area is getting filled up. Get some absinthe uh, encrusted into th things if we really wanted to. You know what I also realized was we could dig out this whole area um, at this point. Kind of like how we had planned. Because at this point, we have the uh, the resources where we could actually use some of the water to turn this into soil. 
And that seems like a good plan to me. I'd also probably slaughter some animals. We go to animals, let's see. Slaughter one of these guys. And a couple of these guys as well. Because they're just limiting our population in terms of like you know females are always more important in a population and their ability to recover so we take out the males and we don't want to go too far because then if you have one that's that's gay it can't reproduce and yes door fortress has gay rabbits that refuse to reproduce and the population will fall apart <laughs> it's pretty epic i'm a little bit worried about this bull not um fertilizing these cows was this the elf trader still here hmm. uh no there's no merchant trading there that i think they're getting packed up or something or maybe they're so mad at us they refuse to trade with us Thought for a minute I saw someone in like sur surgery garbs coming over here. Yes, go ahead and slaughter those rabbits. We must celebrate our survival <laughs> in this dark world. So, this is designated for training. That was gonna make for a separate crew, but I ended up not doing that. What's the deal down here? This is also designated for training. If I look at my squads. Maybe I can stop having you being positioned at that place. Uh, cancel order. The granite speeches is who I want training up here. I just want to double check that I have the right people designated to train here. Yep, the granite speeches should be training. I don't see anyone training. They have their orders. And this is gonna be a huge thing coming down when it does come down. Like if a dwarf is in here, they're gonna just die. <laughs> yeah, there's just so much iron on this map. It's overwhelming, it really is. Like, I don't know how to even handle it. Um, right, we had, um, it, yeah, let's set these so people can get buried in them. This is necessary. I really should be making it so that pets can't get buried in here. Are these things engraved? Yeah, they are actually. Let's check out the engravings and see what they say. Okay, yeah, that one was the basic one. This is the guy and his wife, right? Yeah. Oh, when he was made captain of the guard before he, like, got killed by a jabber. Oh my god, it shows him being struck down by the jabber. And being and colliding with something it's probably like his head or something
This is also an image of someone getting killed by the Jabber. Oh my goodness. <laughs> okay, so that guy made some sort of discovery. Oh yeah, and that's just some hammer that I got put in. Just want to double check that no one else has been buried. I kind of like this idea of engraving the wall behind them so I cannot go back and check what happened to them. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna make this not for pets. Maybe we'll have a set separate pet cemetery. We just want to make sure that our heroes are enshrined properly. Okay. Sounds good to me. Um, let's look at our nobles. You're still mad because you don't have a decent dining room. I do have a table now so I can give you that dining room. My lord. Um, what about you? Needs two chests. The mayor. The Okazaki. Okazaki needs another chest. Um, isn't that underneath H? Pretty sure it is. I'm gonna have to give you a wood chest because we don't have an iron one. Sorry. We got tons of drink, we got tons of food. We have water. Okay, yeah, that seems to be evaporating. It looks like water is not being stored in here. Not really. And they're, they're making their way through the rock. It says it's raining, but it's not enough to actually build up water. I'm not really sure what to do at this point. <laughs> I mean, we could do like some more dwarfiness with the water. Oh yeah, look, this is totally filled up now. If I go to our levers, can I try and flip that lever again? I think I must have messed up the lever. Maybe it retracted instead of going up or something. I don't know. Is that... Okay, I think it's actually engaged now. No? Maybe not. I'm pretty sure it is. Kind of hard to say. There's that, and then if I go up to the meeting hall. I mean, when it's on, it should be up. So one of these tiles should get blocked. This is what I thought would happens in the in this game. To see when it's like that, it seems to me that water is flowing. I'm going to turn it off because obviously having it on 
is uh, there's water flowing for some reason. Yeah, I think I messed up and made it like retract. You can always pump the water out of here. Which I think we might need to do so we can fix that because it seems to me like it's retracting. It's not a big deal. It's just kind of annoying and not really how I intended it. Yeah, this seems to have full filled up now and it's not really flowing with that, I think. I mean, I could totally be wrong. And I could open this up and have the water flow down. But it would just fill up our lower parts here. I'm not really looking to do. <laughs> okay. Good watch those numbers all day, to be honest. I am nervous about this being open. Something could go down into the water here, come in here, and then come up through the well. And what we could do is we could dig out something that's actually higher, like one more higher. And unless it's a flying creature, it's not going to be able to do what I'm, I'm concerned about. I think I might do that. I'm not really sure where to go from here. We could train a ton of war dogs. That would probably not be the worst thing to do. Uh, war training. Yeah, give all of them war training. All the dogs. Uh, We'll have a ton of war dogs, which will actually... War dogs are pretty decent, especially if they swarm, because they can bite and like hold down limbs. If we get them all in the military like that, then next time we get attacked we'll just be like, War dogs, get them! That'll be pretty sweet. Because obviously our dwarves aren't really training. <laughs> You don't think that's important. And this is quite the uh, digging project down here. And they're making progress. They are. Slow but steady. Wins the race, as they say. I'm wondering if people aren't training because we don't have a um, which call it because we don't have a person in charge, a noble. So Jem Jemson, we could make our military captain. Yeah, let's do that. And I think Heisenberg is is a captain as well. Okay, Linnaeus, we gotta deal with with the table thing. You should have a table now. Isn't this for Linnaeus? Yep, assigned to Linnaeus. Our nobles should be happy now. Linnaeus wants fancier quarters. Do we have any anything that we could give him? Uh, 
let's see. Do you have any iron cabinets? I know they, they like their iron cabinets. Um, let's see if that does it. I don't want to invest too much in him. He's just the mayor. We've got barons all over this place. <laughs> How long have I been recording for now? About half an hour, actually. Alright, I think I'm going to end this episode here. Thank you for joining me. This has been Orange One.